Hello, everyone. Thank you for joining. My name is Elis Halilovic, and I'm technical sales engineer at XR ETI. I would like to welcome you all at today's uh, workshop, uh, Efficient Engineering with ETI Article Database on Vasket Universe. The main goal of today's workshop is for you to get familiar with ETI parts on Vasket Universe. Uh, this workshop is being recorded, and you will get the recordings afterward as well. At the end of the uh, workshop, the survey will appear in your browser regarding your impression of this uh, workshop. We would really appreciate your feedback, so please, if you could, uh, fill it out. Uh, today with me will be our guest speaker from ETI company, Janes Sirar, uh, a product manager that will be joining us uh, later to showcase ETI parts from the, uh, from ETI that are already on VSCAD Universe. He will give you more in detail explanation of their parts. And on the right, there is me and I'll be representing XOR ETI. Now let's see what we will cover on today's workshop. First off, we will start with our company profile and who we are as XOR ETI. Then we will go over general facts uh, about VSCAD and VSCAD Universe. After that, our guest speaker, Mr. Cirar, will take over and speak about ETI parts on the biggest database VSCAD universe. Uh, then we'll go back to me uh, and where I will be talking about the process of making ETI, par ETI parts and benefits of using ETI parts for engineering. At the very end, we will have a Q&A section. You can submit your questions in the chat box or Q&A section on the Zoom. So who we are? We are Exoretti and we offer innovative software and hardware solutions from world leading manufacturers for industrial energy automation and digitization. We have uh, many partners and, and Westcad is uh, one among them. We offer services for individual solutions to your needs, provide uh, consulting services and technical support. We are present in eight countries from Slovenia to Mar uh, Macedonia, and we have uh, three offices in Slovenia, Croatia, and Serbia. So let's go uh, to the next topic, the VSCAD and VSCAD uh, universe. First, I would like to say a little bit more about the VSCAD in general. Uh, the company has uh, more than 30 years of experience and they are part of the Bull Group that has over 700 employees. It is uh, present uh, in 26 countries and has uh, 35,000 users worldwide. And one interesting fact that they reinvest about 25% of the revenue back to the R&D department. Regarding the industries, our focus is on machinery and plant engineering, building automation and electrical installation. Uh, this solution is made of uh, out of three components. First one is the main product, VSCAD Electrics. It is an engineering software for drawing the schematics. Sec second part is VSCAD Universe, which is today's topic, today uh, together with ETI parts. Uh, this is an article database where you just select wanted ETI parts and import it to your own local database. And at last, we have AR applications. So we have uh, one important question. The survey was held and, the, and that, that question was, would you prefer another vendor, another manufacturer because they offer uh, native CAD models? And 72% uh, said yes. With VSCAD Universe, you can choose any manufacturer that you want. So if you create articles manually, it usually takes five to six steps. First, you open article database and check if the article exists or not. Second step is that you need to create and draw your own symbols. And you have to uh, look on the manufacturer's website for all of the, those uh, data, like length, width, uh, current, etc., cetera, uh, and to type it in manually. Afterwards, you would also need to do some testing. And if you go for the cabinet and cabinet uh, 3D data, uh, you would have to do this uh, multiple times. Let's take, for example, a medium-sized project that requires about 50 new articles. And let's say that each article takes on average uh, 60 minutes. With this formula, we waste about uh, 
50 hours of our time just on creating the articles that we could have used on engineering. Having that data available in uh, VSCAD universe, that means that you only have to do two steps. First, first one is that you just type in the name of the part that you want and you download it to your local database. And the second part is uh, you just drag and drop it to the schematics and the problem is uh, solved. As you can see, you can save yourself a great amount of time. Uh, VSCAD Universe database has uh, more than 1.4 million components from more than uh, 382 manufacturers. We have several, several different uh, available formats like a native uh, VSCAD format, EDZ, DXF and DVG and 3D step format. It is also A-class compatible and we have a very fast and tech sensitive search function that uh, with uh, that we address over 145,000 uh, users worldwide. Uh, per year, we have uh, about 2.1 million searches and about 1 million downloads. The good thing is uh, that we have a good annual growth, about 40% for users and 35% for uh, manufacturers. It is a native cloud application and it is integrated with electric software and therefore awarded as best ACAD article database. Uh, the best thing is, it is free of charge for users and the manufacturers. Uh, this is the engineering process with uh, VSCAD. On the left side, we have input data and all uh, available formats like PDF, DVG, DXF, uh, XML, and from Airplan. We have ERP sync tool and the VSCAD universe uh, database. On the right side, we have the output data. Uh, again, all available formats and it's all uh, BIM uh, ready. We have different interfaces, as you can see, for Siemens, Comax, CAT cable, and more, and these AR applications. As you can see, the VSCAD universe is uh, frequently updated. Every month, we get about one to three new manufacturers, about 50 updated manufacturers, and 30 to 50,000 articles updates as well as EDZ and the many step files updates. And we are currently working on ETI Electroelement database. Uh, here you can see uh, the VSCAD Universe Go extension and step-by-step uh, -step how to import one part from manufacturer's website. Uh, also, the opposite way is possible with ETI add-on. It, it was designed to simplify the search process uh, for ETI products and save, you, and save you valuable time. Also, another possibility is available, and that is a bill of material import uh, file. You can load a large quantities of the parts via CSV file. It is easy to use, and you get direct feedback, and you get yourself a easy download parts. Uh, all symbols from VSCAD Universe are also available as DVG format. You can uh, use VSCAD to get DVG drawing for your AutoCAD. That means that you don't have to draw symbols by yourself. Manufacturers automatically receive the DVG. There is no additional cost. Now I want to say about uh, all the possibilities of uh, VSCAD electrics in general. Uh, this is a modular and scalable software and it is useful for planning, designing, and development of uh, electrical machines, plants, and buildings. As you can see here, we have uh, six disciplines, electrical engineering, cabinet engineering, fluid engineering, PNID, building automation, and electrical installation. The electrical engineering disciplines enables engineers and designers to plan, develop, and document medium to low voltage systems. In the electrical engineering discipline, the classic engin electrical engineering is done. You can uh, make uh, one pole, three pole schemes, uh, powering the, of the entire system, place terminals, relays, and it also enables PLC functionalities. Uh, you can also uh, create complete documentation, cable lists, terminal lists, material lists, everything. In the process flow below, uh, we can see the whole process. We, we start by creating the cabinet uh, schematics, design our own cab uh, cabinet layout. We can open 3D view and uh, do collision check. 
it enables us to do automatic routing, calculating uh, wire lengths. Uh, we can display the fill ratio of the cable ducts, print QR codes and labels, and we can use those uh, QR codes for maintenance with this AR app. Uh, these are the rest of the disciplines that we will cover some other time. Uh, I would like to mention a few more customers who successfully deployed uh, VSCAD in their everyday work. And we have here ABB, AMD, uh, Philips, Siemens, Vago, and many others. Uh, thank you for your attention. Now our guest speaker, Yanis uh, Cira, will tell you a bit more about ETI parts. Uh, welcome, Mr. Cira, the word is yours. Thank you, Elvis. Uh, my name is Janes Sirak. I'm product manager for software for designers in ATI Electro Element Slovenia. So I will first introduce AT and then uh, AT parts and then the end AT base cat parts. Okay. Who is AT? AT is one of the world's leading providers of products and services in the field of protection of electrical installations. We are the most, the customer recognizes us with the fuses, MCBs, AFIs, and uh, ceramic products. More information about the products can be found on the AT site, www.atgroup.eu or visit YouTube on our YouTube channel. AT have a product range of protection from half amp to 6,300 amp. And uh, these are protections with fuses, MCBs, air circuit breakers. And uh, what is the most important, we are among top five largest producers of fuses in the world. Little about our history. The company was established in 1950. First products of electro porcelain was in 54. And then the first fuse in 60. And first miniature secret breaker in 77. And in 80, we start with automatization. In end of the 90s, we established the first 80 subsidiary. In 2006, it became a system integration. 2008, we started with a photovoltaic GPV protection diffuses. In 2012, it Polam started with Pena Binder. In 2014, we start with lean principles of production. And uh, 2017, we have Six Sigma principles. AT have a lot of subsidiaries. You see in the East Europe, AT Baltus, Ukraine, Poland, Germany, Czech Republic, Serbia, and uh, in some of subsidiaries, we have also production, like in AT Poland and AT Sarajevo. You can find us all over the world. Our products are all over the world. AT partners are ABB, Siemens, Eton, Gewiss, Gara, and also Schneider. When we start with the basket parts, we have a goal. AT will have the best wastegate parts in the world. And uh, we analyze the components, analyze parts, analyze good parts, bad parts, and see the benefits of the good parts. And here is this, our two samples of uh, our parts in wastegate universe. You see a lot of data inside. And uh, here's also a link to external document. This is a link to our web page. Uh, 
uh, of the products. You see here a lot of data for designers, voltage, amps, characteristics, and so on. And uh, if we scroll down a li little bit more, we have also here related products, quite similar, and also accessories in this sample fuse basis, which are suitable for this fuse link. On this product page, designers have a lot of other stuff like 3D models. These are step models, uh, also quality made, uh, and also designer can here measure the model or get the overall size XYZ of the model. Here we can also create PDF data sheet. All of the data of this product page are converted to PDF together with characteristics and uh, other documents. But the documents are also technical data catalog, certificates, CEA declarations, instruction manual, and also here we have e plan file of this project. You can directly download it. I mentioned software for Eti. Uh, in this sample of the fuse, if we go to the characteristics, we see this digital version of IT characteristic of the fuse. We can have a comparison with other characteristics, like here in this sample, three different characteristics. We can add some more data inside. Here we have 20, 25, and 32 amps characteristics. And you can also measure the current and time from this time characteristic. You can save it or print it and send it to friends. From the software, I can mention also our great software etiquette. Uh, this is plugin library for CAD programs, AutoCAD, ZVCAD, BricsCAD, GisterCAD, RogerCAD. And uh, in this add-on program for CAD are inside 11,000 different AT products. Inside each it product product have symbol and to the view. And uh, a great benefit of this software is automatic calculating the products from other words, bill of material, boom. Okay, basic 80 parts, 80 have made together with XR80 parts in 11 different languages. Why? Because of our subsidiaries. We are thinking on our subsidiaries. We are thinking on other people, other languages. So we made F different languages data. Each part of our product have in VSCAT pin connection. This is for basket automation wiring. Why? To shorter designer time. And uh, we are very proud on unique, special for basket made 83 d models, and which we can present it, present it on the some presentation. I will show you an example of uh, our 
3D parts. This is export from VSCAT, our products. In this sample, we see NH fuses of different parts. You see a lot of details inside. In these samples are our program from switches, ASTI program, MCBs, AFIs, and CASAS, residual devices. And also we cover this D0 program with fuses with excellent 3D models. You see, you see details inside. We will also have future products with VSCAT. We, we, we are now on making great data, great parts with this motor protection, motor relays, switches, and also cabinets. And our goal is to shorter designing time and to raise the quality of the project. For 80, 880 have for designers some data on web page, www.etigroup.eu, and also on YouTube films, please see it. Also, you can download free software and fill registration form to be informed about ETI software novelties from our web page, like ETICAD. ETI also organizes designer trainings and educations. And please contact us for technical support for designers on support at ET.se. ET is thinking of safety, so you don't have to. Thank you. Thank you, Yanis. It was a beautiful presentation. Now let's uh, take a look at how the process of making ETI article database take place. Uh, so first off, we received uh, very well prepared data from ETI. As you can see, here, we have uh, part numbers, product names, uh, VSCAD, uh, tree structure, uh, category, subcategory, and even the series, as well as all description in 11 languages, short description and long description. At the very end, we have product data like voltage, uh, current and uh, dissipation. And for easier manipulation of the data, we have to uh, split it in the few different segments, as you can see here. If you open uh, some examples, uh, here we entered all information about uh, manufacturer, in this case, uh, at the electro element. Here you can see all information about the parts, the voltage, current, external doc document. Uh, as well as followed by power dissipation and many more frequency, voltage, etc. We have uh, part numbers and part names. And all of this has been assigned to correct uh, corresponding part. In this Excel, we have linked all the symbols, single pole, uh, three pole and cabinet symbols to correct parts. And the same goes for the 3D models and their uh, orientation. So when you look at the part, when you place it in the cabinet, it's positioned correctly. In the cabinet segment, we have assigned correct pin positions for automatic routing of the cables in cabinet, and also added width, height, and the length of the parts. So this is all over the place. And let's see how it looks in the MS access, where we assembled the previously mentioned data into one cohesive file. We can find here all the data mentioned before, and this is how we upload it to the VSCAD universe. Uh, we can also open electrics and check how the data looks from an engineer's perspective. If we go and open ETI part, 
uh, we can see all the data in more intuitive environment. We can see part number, the 3D uh, model and its positioning. Also, we can open the pin positions where the pins are drawn and the dimensions are shown. Uh, weight of the product, again, uh, category and subcategory, the dimensions, uh, corresponding symbols from the library, and at the end, uh, power dissipation and ambient temperature, frequency, minimum and maximum frequency, uh, minimum and maximum voltage, uh, voltage type, uh, rated current and rated uh, voltage, as well as connection to the external document. And at last, uh, for today, are the benefits of the using ETI parts for engineering. Yet again, we'll go uh, through the whole process. Uh, <clears throat> we open the ETI uh, web page, search for the wanted parts that we want to use it in our project. Uh, simply highlight the product ETI code and search it with this uh, extension, add it to the cart and go for the next product. And this cart doesn't mean that you have to pay for something. It is just a place uh, where the all parts that you download will be stored for later export. So if we add this one and at last we add one MCB. The process is the same. We highlight it, search it for the VESCAD on the VESCAD universe and add it to the cart. Also vice versa is possible. If you find some part that you want to use uh, on the VESCAD universe and you want to see more in detail explanation, the characteristics on the ETI page, you can do the same thing uh, with this uh, ETI add-on extension from, for Mozilla Firefox. You can find here the technical data catalog, instruction manual, logistics data, uh, some certificates and certifications. So both ways work. So, and let's go back to the Vesca universe where we can see uh, our downloaded parts. We create the package, download it, and go back to the electrics to import those parts with uh, import wizard. We choose the correct uh, RAR file. And it asks us, uh, because I have those symbols already in my library, do we want to overwrite them? Click yes, and all of those parts are being changed and added to our local database. Now let's uh, place some parts on the schematics. We simply search for the part on the VSCAD universe and place it uh, to our schematics where we uh, can choose what text will be displayed. In this case, we chose uh, the part number and the manufacturer. Let's do the same for the rest two symbols. And yet again, we chose just the part number and the manufacturer. Uh, we can also open one uh, part to see what data is available. As you can see here, these are 11 languages that are available, German, English, Hungarian, Polish, Croatian, etc. We can open uh, the part to see it more in detail. Yet again, uh, open 3D model, move it around to see how it looks. Check the connection point of this part. Yet again, uh, weight is there, category, subcategory, dimensions, correct dimensions, 
and all the, of the symbols. Single pole symbol we can find here, the three pole single, and the cabinet symbol. The power dissipation, minimum and maximum ambient temperature, minimum and maximum frequency, voltage, voltage type, rated uh, current and uh, voltage, and connection to the external document. So if we now open the cabinet schematics, uh, we can place uh, those uh, parts from the, directly from the material exp explorer on the right. We scroll down and find the correct parts. We can simply place the one by one. We can open that part and select the reference name to be shown. Or also we can place multiple symbols uh, at the same time. And now we'll do the automatic uh, wiring. Uh, firstly, we will go to 3D view and check it, the whole cabinet, how it looks like. And we'll do the routing now. As you can see, all the connected pins are correctly positioned and the wires are uh, drawn. And this is very beneficial uh, while using VSCAD, so you don't have to do this manually and uh, you can later produce the wire sets uh, more easily with uh, our uh, interfaces that we have available. So let's go to another functionality and that is a bill of material list. You can download the template. Uh, let's see how it uh, looks like. In the first column, you put the manufacturer, and in the second column, you put the part number. I have already prepared one uh, bomb list that we will uh, upload to the universe. And uh, here we can see that uh, it is searching for our parts, and we will get direct feedback. Here we can see that uh, 19 of those parts were found. And you can see here the list and two parts are missing, but don't worry, we are working on it. And this is going to be uploaded uh, very soon. So the same way we download the parts, we create a package and the same way we are a wizard, we import it to our local database. And yet again, it asks us, do we want to overwrite uh, already existing symbols? And while we are waiting for this, this is very beneficial for the users that already has some kind of uh, bill of material list. You just uh, uh, correct it to the correct format and you upload it to the universe and you get your parts uh, with just a few clicks and the minor modifications. You see the old data being uh, updated. And that's it from this. And let's see what parts were imported. We filtered it by the ETI manufacturer and see 28 uh, parts found in our database. 19 of them were uh, uploaded by a bomb list, three of them manually. The rest of them were in our database prior to this. And that will be uh, all from my side. Uh, we will now uh, begin our Q&A section of the workshop. So some questions have already arrived. And one first question is for uh, Yanis. Uh, does ETI have a software for selecting the right electrical protection? Hmm. Uh, yes, uh, I will share the screen. 
Okay. Uh, you ask for protection. Yes, uh, we have on our web page uh, in the software menu, we have a, a software for designer. And here we have Etison. This is specially made program for making the right protection with IT curves. And we can draw and analyze IT curves, simulate loads, and uh, make the right protection. Okay, here is a short film of this. We, we select AMP and then characteristic type of fuse links and voltage. And we for result receive a curve. Then we can choose another fuse link and see the differences between them. Here we select another fuse link, the same amp with different characteristics and we see the differences between the characteristics. Also, we can write down the comments. I will write down, uh, write down uh, F1 for this fuse and for GF fuse F2 regarding the schematics. So, okay. And uh, we can also insert a title of this. We can save this version and send it to friend. And also I have here another movie of our Edison. I will show you a little bit more to set our limit conditions on the characteristics for 20 amp and another limit condition for 150 amp. And uh, also we will insert a working point. Let me say for amp, 80 amps for time of five seconds, insert. And now you see a point appear in the middle of the characteristic. Okay, now we, are, we will searching for protection. We will take, uh, okay, 20 amp of MCB, draw a core. Uh -huh. We see that this working point is in the middle of the correct characteristic. Uh, we will select another fuse, GG fuse. We'll try with this one. Uh -huh. And see that it is on the left side of the working point, which is very good made. Okay, we will add some text. Why this MCB is not good. Okay, not fast enough. And also we will make some comment for GGFuse that this fuse make the better protection. It is on the left side of the working point. Please uh, see also more videos on YouTube about this Edison. Uh, install it on computer. This is XFL. It is free version. And uh, if you have any idea in the comments, please write on support at 80.se. Okay, I think I have answered uh, the question. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Yanis. Uh, we got also a few more questions left. And one is, do you have 3D models for any parts? Yes, uh, we have, uh, for each part, we have the corresponding 3D model. The next question is, uh, do you have the description of the parts in Serbian language? Uh, we are working on it and it will also be uh, there. The last question is, do you think that the VSCAD is better than CE Electric from Schneider Electric? Uh, we never talk about the competition. It is up to you to decide whether it's, uh, whether VSCAD provides you more functionalities and more opportunities for faster work 
in the engineering software. And one last question uh, is, how do you make simple events get that uh, isn't in the standard library? For a simple that isn't in the star standard library, we can either draw it manually in the simple editor, or we can uh, take DVG uh, of that symbol. If you have it from uh, some other CAD software and revive it in just a few clicks, because uh, VS CAD has this functionality that recognizes the whole symbols and you convert it to the smart object, uh, where you just put uh, do some touch-ups uh, like adding pins and put standardized te text that are already prepared by Electrix, and you can save it to your local uh, library and you are ready to go. I think uh, that uh, those are all of the questions. Uh, so thank you everyone for joining and we will uh, end this. Thank you very much.